Mike Moore Media. I'm talking with Ashley Cooper, Community Outreach and Development Director with ADTS, Aging Disability and Transit Services of Rockingham County. She's on the line now. Hey, Ashley, how you doing? Hi, Mike. Thank you for having me. I appreciate the good work that ADTS does in Rockingham County. We all do. Uh, but we want to talk today about the volunteer recruitment drive. Local nonprofits need our help. So tell us about this, Ashley. Absolutely. So this came out of a meeting at Livable Rockingham. We were having some discussions about what are some of the needs in our community, and several nonprofits attend that meeting, and they said that they desperately need volunteers. And I know at ADTS, one of the programs that we provide is Meals on Wheels, and we desperately need volunteers. Our average age of volunteer is 79 years old. So we have to start looking about how we're going to recruit volunteers, and we realized we weren't alone in that. And so we thought, why don't we partner together with other nonprofits in the community who need volunteers, and uh, let's try to do that where we know younger, uh, older adults are and see if they might have the time to give. I want to stop right there where you said the average age of a volunteer for Meals on Wheels is 79. So you're looking at serving really people even younger than some of your volunteers, aren't you? Yes, we are. Oh, Absolutely. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Well, volunteers are always needed in so many ways. They make the world go round, don't they? They do. They do. They're the heart of the community, and we want to make sure that they know that they have opportunities in our community to volunteer. Sure, yeah. Well, tell us about this uh, recruitment drive. It's really uh, launching tomorrow at Hive in Uptown Eden and uh, three different uh, uh, areas that you'll be doing this in in the county. But uh, you were just telling me before we started, how exciting is this, the first one in the nation? It is. Um, Livable Rockingham is partnering with AARP North Carolina to create a volunteer recruitment drive. It is the first one in the nation, so we are a test case. And if this works out well, which I know that it will, um, they will take this model and replicate it throughout the country. And we're really excited for that opportunity. AARP North Carolina has sent out over 3,000 postcards. To their members in Rockingham County, letting them know that this is an opportunity for them to engage in their community. And we're really excited to partner and really extend our goal of recruiting more volunteers. Okay. Well, tell us about uh, what's coming up starting tomorrow, then the, uh, the 21st, the 28th, and all of that, Ashley. Sure, absolutely. So we wanted to, since, since we know our volunteers are aging and we're trying to recruit younger volunteers, we we're trying to figure out where do younger people hang out, and they hang out in breweries and coffee shops because I, that's where I hang out. So mm-hmm. I see lots of people my age there. Mm-hmm. And um, we are partnering with Hive tomorrow, Thursday, September 14th, from 4:30 to 6:30, and we have about 10 nonprofits who are going to be set up to talk about their mission and what their volunteer needs are, and any participants who attend will receive a free beverage ticket. We'll have food there as well. And it's a great opportunity to hear about specifically what are your needs, what are the volunteer opportunities within your community. Um, And we're going to set this up again on Thursday, September 21st at the River Club Brewery in Madison at the same time from 4.30 to 6.30. Mm -hmm. And then again on Thursday, September 28th at Sip Coffee in Reedsville. And that one's actually from 9 to 11 a.m. And, again, everyone who attends will receive a beverage ticket. There will be food there. There will be different organizations from your community who are looking for volunteers who are also interested in sharing what they're doing and how they're supporting their community. And we're really excited to get this kicked off. Oh, I'm excited with you. Yeah. Well, these are, uh, are excellent spots, it sounds like, to, uh, to target uh, some volunteers, hopefully. So when, when we come to these, um, now you mentioned it at Hive specifically okay. starting tomorrow, there will be 10 nonprofits represented there. Is that pretty much what you'll be doing at the others as well? Yes, absolutely. But there will be different nonprofits. So right. tomorrow okay. we'll have Meals on Wheels. Uh, We'll have Rockingham County Schools there to talk about uh, volunteers they need for tutoring, Dan River Keepers, Friends of Eden Animal Rescue, Home of Refuge Outreach, Hospice of Rockingham County, Landings of Rockingham, 
Life's Blessing Soup Kitchen, and the Garden Worship and Outreach Center, as well as Livable Rockingham and AARP. Mm-hmm. So at each location, the one in, in Eden and then uh, in uh, downtown Madison next week and then uh, finishing up on the 28th at uh, Sip Coffee House. I was just there the other day, as a matter of fact. So there'll be uh, different uh, ones representing that community, as you said. Yes, there will be. Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, so you have... And, you know, it's really important because we do know that people like to volunteer within their community. And also often volunteering needs to be an easy process for someone because we're asking them to give up their time. And a lot of times they have very limited amount of time. Mm -hmm. So we don't want to bring in agencies or nonprofits that might serve Madison and somebody lives in Eden. And so we're really trying to tailor those individual organizations um, at each um, event to represent strictly that community. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, this sounds like a, a great idea to uh, make those connections. Okay, well, thank you for the update on this. Uh, and, and again, um, just thinking about this as being a, kind of a, a test here for uh, across the United States here with uh, AARP Triad Region and uh, how exciting it is to be a part of that, for sure. Yes, absolutely. And if anybody has any questions, they can always reach out to me. Um, the best way to reach me is over the phone, which is 336-394-1313, and that's 336-394-1313. Okay. Well, we have another couple of minutes. Anything else in particular going on with ADTS of Rockingham County maybe you wanted to mention, Ashley? Sure. So I don't know if people know that recently we kicked off a Veterans um, Express Shuttle to the Kernsville VA Hospital. Uh, that is something that is free to veterans, and it runs on Monday um, every hour from the different Walmart locations. And um, all we do is all we ask is that people call and they make a reservation, and uh, we can get them set up and get them there without any problem. And that also means that anything that's around that area to the um, around the VA hospital, can, they can also go to. So there's a lot of different medical facilities in that space as well. So we're really excited to offer that. Um, But we also recently signed a contract with the Veterans Administration to offer in-home services and to offer support uh, at our Life Enrichment and Adult Friendship Center, which is our Adult Day Center in Reedsville. So we're really trying to target our veterans. I don't know if you know this, but we have close to 5,000 veterans in our community, Mm -hmm. and we're sure that they're in need of things as they age, and we want to make sure that they are aware of what's available to them. Well, thank you for telling us. I I did not know about the the, the shuttle, so uh, that's that's good to know that that's uh, running, and I know... um, for a time, uh, there were some folks um, in the Wentworth area um, with um, a group there that was working on that. And then all, all of those people began to age out and, and leave us. And so this is good to know that ADTS has really picked that up. Yes, absolutely. It was a concerted effort, and we heard about that need and really tried to um, find a solution, which mm-hmm. we have. And we're excited to offer that for our veterans. Okay. Uh, finding uh, solutions, uh, meeting the needs here in Rockingham County in so many ways. And ADTS has uh, has really uh, been around for a good while and doing a lot of good things. So thank you for, for your hard work and, and everyone there involved. Thank you for that, Ashley. Sure, absolutely. And we actually are celebrating our 50th year. So we have been in the community for quite a long time, and we're glad that we can be great partners and solution makers. Well, I was about to ask how many years, but I didn't want to put you on the spot, but is it 50, <laughs> 50 years this year? It is 50 this year. Yes, it is. Oh, wow. Yes, is. Well, happy mm-hmm. anniversary. Oh, that is great. Thank you. Yeah, 50 Thank years you of service. Much. Wow. Okay. Well, Ashley, again, uh, thanks to ADTS, and thanks for you uh, being on the program so we can find out about some things coming up that we can get involved in and and uh, help as a volunteer, specifically with some of the things we're talking about. And we'll talk again. Okay, that sounds great. Thanks a lot. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye. I wanted you to hear firsthand about some of the good things happening with ADTS of Rockingham County Aging Disability and Transit Services. Their office is there in Reedsville, but uh, they're all over Rockingham County doing so many good things. Ashley Cooper, our guest, Community Outreach and Development Director with ADTS of Rockingham County. Uh, Please try to get to Hive in Uptown Eden tomorrow. 
That will be 430 to 630. We need your help as nonprofits around the county as a volunteer. And then at the River Club in downtown Madison on Thursday, September 21st, same time as high, 430 to 630. And then uh, Thursday, September 28th at Sip Coffee House uh, right there in downtown Reedsville. That will be from 9 until 11 that morning. If you uh, can spare a moment, your expertise and passion can impact and change your community. Now, for more information, you can get to Ashley. Call her at 336-394-1313, 394-1313. And thanks for your help.